practice it exercise 5.1 show twos we are asked to write a method named show twos that shows the factors of two in a given integer we're given the example calls and we are also given the your, their specific outputs so to do this we first need to write our method it's going to be public static void called show twos we are taking an integer as a parameter so we call this int n and we could really title this anything we want it's returning void and that's why that's void is there and the first thing that we're going to print out is this part we need to print out the number and then an equal sign and then a space so we'll do this we'll do a system.out.print not print line just print and this will become relevant later and we have our number we also have our equal sign our number has to go outside of our parentheses though like this so we have n plus and then the string space equals space once we have that we can move on to the next part which is a loop and this loop will run as long as we need as long as our number is divisible by 2 so we're gonna have a while loop and to know it's divisible by 2 and not this some other number um, we're going to do n modulus 2 is equal to 0. So 68 for example it's divisible by 2 without a remainder. It's divisible by 2 again because 68 divided by 2 is 34, 34 2, or 34 divided by 2 will be 17. This gives us a remainder so we'll break out of this while loop and then we are just going to print that remainder. So what we're going to do in here is have a system dot out dot print and it's going to continue on this line and in here we're just going to print out two times and then a space and then after we do that we take our number and we divide it by two so we're going to do divides equal two what this is basically saying is n is equal to n divided by two the way we're writing it though is like this just like we can write n plus equals some number so now that we have this we can just print out our n so we'll do a system dot out dot print still on the same line and we're just going to have n in here like this i definitely need to spell that better and after we do that we can submit and see that we have passed all six tests again what we're doing here is we are making a method and we are printing out the number and then the equal sign so that this beginning part is taken care of then we're going to go in this while loop and as long as it is divisible by two we're going to print out two times and then we are going to divide our number by two and then keep running this until it cannot be divided by two once it cannot be divided by two that means that is the last um, number that we need to complete this line and we can just print out that number. So this is the code that will give us this output for this problem.